Hi, welcome to my channel. No, 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 not yet, not yet. I'm in the background, bro. Weird little. Okay, ready? Ready? No. Okay. Hi, good morning, evening, afternoon, wherever you are in the world, and welcome to my channel. As you can tell by the thumbnail and the title, I thought that I would do an update on my working life and how it's all going down. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe down below. We have finally hit my target of 500, which I am so, so, so thankful for. So thank you to everyone who has made that happen. Click the little box down below to subscribe and keep notified whenever I upload another video. If you want, I have actually got a Lush playlist, so I will be popping up right here. So if you wanted to see any other videos that are still related to Lush and wanted to watch them, click up there. We are going to start by talking about me going back to work. Lush has opened. Where I work, we have a certain we have a certain way that we're doing it at the moment. So, I'll insert pic I'm going to move over. I'm going to insert pictures here of how my shop is actually running at the moment. This is how we are running it at the moment. So, where I work at Lush, this is how we're doing things. We are doing what we call a kiosk way a kiosk we're doing a kiosk what that means is that when you get to the till you can actually ask one of us or you can say what you want if you know your bits you can run and grab them for you and um, we're also doing a little click clack clack a little click and collect service which is where you can email our shop or phone up our shop and you can say what you want to order then we can prepare it for you so when you arrive it's already to Go, and it's just very quick and easy for you and then if you do arrive there and you're a bit like unsure about what you want to get we're always there to advise products so if it's skincare bath bombs gifts still the same thing just can't come into the shop at the moment or smell things or touch things unless you're gonna purchase so that is that's how I'm working at the moment. It's quite different because I'm so used to people coming into the shop, but you know, we're still getting lovely customers and you know, everyone is happy that we're open, which is the main thing and we're keeping everyone safe and ourselves safe and we're just trying to, you know, do the best that we can as a business. So I'm so happy that we're finally open. Literally feels like forever. Go to a local Lush shop, might be open, might be doing it that way, but this is how my shop is doing it. So I thought that if anyone was interested in how Lush was actually running that's how we're doing things so with that all being said if there's any questions please let me know in the comments below and I will try and answer them and I thought that in to include in to yeah I thought with this video that I would also talk about products that I have missed whilst being in lockdown with Lush so let's get into that let's start with number one this one probably one of my favorite go-to lush products and this is called aroma water it's a toner water but i literally use it to make me wake up in the morning i refresh in my face i use it as like a makeup setting spray if it's a hot day i use it to cool me down put them in the fridge they feel so good on my face and my whole body basically so my baby i have been running low on my other bottle so i've picked one up put it in my basket Inside here you do have lavender water and rose water so they're really good if you've got quite sensitive skin or you're looking for something to just help cool the skin down, it helps with redness, irritation and also you, it does help remove any dirt and bacteria because it is a toner water as well. So yeah. <sighs> What's these? Yeah. I've also picked up a cleanser. Now I haven't been cleansing my face properly whilst in lockdown which is pretty bad so I thought you know what got the products gonna start cleansing my face a lot more and I picked this one up this is called let the good times roll and if you're not sure about lush products then this one has popcorn cinnamon inside and maize flour so it's a really gentle exfoliation and it smells like cookies and it's just so sweet and it has chunks of popcorn in there as well so you know if you're missing the cinema so yeah I grabbed this one and I thought you know what my skin is quite dry at the moment and this one does wonders for my skin so I picked this one up and now this is back in my life and then I obviously have missed bath bombs and so has my family oh they're downstairs okay sorry if the camera angle has changed I ran downstairs and got the bath bombs these are just a few and my brother has actually 
used to all of the ones that I got last time. So they're gone. I will insert pictures if I can find them on the internet. Lush were meant to bring out some bubble bars and unfortunately we weren't able to. So I think you can still get them online if you order them. The ones that I got him, I'll pop up here. So this one was a crayon and he loved it so much so I would definitely recommend getting this one and it was quite sweet as well and you can actually like draw on the bar for on tiles and it washes off really easily as well so it's quite fun and the bubbles were insane then I've also got him the strawberries and cream bath bomb which my mum and him loved so much I've missed like I don't really have baths but when I do I really love like really strong smelling ones or something that's going to make my skin feel amazing inside it has cocoa butter um, and then you've also got a strawberry scented bath bomb so it is really lovely I got those and but he's used them so yeah oh and I also get the guilt I also did get groovy kind of love which we have in our store and we're still selling which is this bath bomb right here it's like sugary sweet sherbet and it's really really colorful so it looks insane in the bath then I've also got some more here so we've got this bath bomb which was for my mum and then my brother actually was like um no I'll have that it's sex bomb it's <sighs> this is a really stunning bath bomb and it also it also has jasmine inside as well so it's quite floral but it's really light and then you've got a lovely pink purple bath and then you've also got a rice paper flower in the middle that foams out and just floats around the bath and looks really pretty Mm. And then I also picked up this bath bomb here. This is called the Olive Branch Bath Bomb. And as you can probably guess, it does have fair trade organic olive oil inside as well. So it makes your skin feel so, so good afterwards. It's really light, fresh. It's like, um, it's like a clean soap smell and then you've got the orange really light orange and the white um swirls so in the bath it looks really pretty and then i picked up oh, bath bomb everywhere a bath warmer for myself because if i'm gonna have a bath like i said i want it to do really really good things for my skin this is called the rose <laughs> this is called the rose salt cube uh, I'm not really good at remembering names. Inside it has some lovely rose and also some Epsom salts. So the Epsom salts are really good for relaxing muscles and that's why I grabbed this one because I was like, I need that. Why is my, bro my brother's barking? And then I also grabbed, my family's outside in the garden. I also picked up this crazy looking bubble bar. Now not sure what it's called but it's exclusive so if i do find it online i will post it here there will also be a link down below if you do want to be a yeah so if you do want to do a little bit of shopping and go straight to the lush website then you can go and see that but i prefer bubble bars over bath bombs let me know your opinion on that in the comments down below again this one smells like i don't even know the ingredients okay I'm getting like a very fruity smell, but not too strong. And a hint of floral. I like it. So yeah, crazy, funky bubble bar. And then I also do have a shampoo that's actually downstairs, but my brother's in the shower, so thanks bro. I will post a picture up here. Now this shampoo literally is amazing. It feels, my hair is, Thanks, Jack. My hair literally feels silkier. It just looks shinier. It looks healthier. And it has inside there some seaweed as well. It's very enzymic, um, but it's not too strong. My scalp is quite oily, so that's why it really helps. But then if it does go onto my ends, it doesn't dry them out because it's not too enzymic. And it has the seaweed as well to help soften the hair. So literally, it's my best friend. It's my best friend. Another product that I have missed and even forgot that I missed it, that's how long I've been away from Lush, is the Comforter Body Spray. If I could do smell of vision right now, I would. The Comforter Body Spray literally smells like blackcurrant, bubble gums, all things sweet, all things great. So good. If you could imagine just a massive bubble gum and stepping inside of it, 
that's what this would smell like. I saw it and I was like, oh, I forgot about that. Had to get it. So yeah, those are all my products that I have missed whilst being in lockdown, isolation. And that is how I am working at the moment. We're not sure when it will change. Probably all the stores are doing it as well, just to give you a little insight if you're thinking of maybe going there. And I'll be doing some more Lush videos soon, so keep an eye out for that. And you can press the little bell down below if you want to be notified when I do that. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you're all staying safe and I will see you soon with another video. Bye.